Well, just in time to freshen up your home decor for summer, Hallmark artist Lindsay Balo is here with a DIY felt succulent wreath, and you are a visual a merchandising designer. What exactly is that? So uh, my role and my department is responsible for taking all of the great Hallmark creative product that they come up with and finding an awesome and creative way to display it in Hallmark retail environments all across the country. Creating little Hallmark heavens everywhere. That's right. Now, oh, by I the like way, that. Hallmark heavens. I know. We're going to try to get like through that. this segment without crying. But, <laughs> yeah. but, but the inspiration for this felt succulent wreath actually came from your own wedding. It did. So um, succulents were a big part of the uh, design concept for our wedding, and we tried to work them in as wherever we could. And uh, we put them on these felt ones on the ring bearer's pillow and the flower girl's little basket as like just a little nod to the succulents that we were hearing in our bouquets. It was great. Well, you started earlier this morning and let's take a look at what you did. That sounds great. First, uh, you start with your felt and on the templates that you can download from the Think Make Share blog, which we'll have a link to at the end. You trace the templates out onto the felt. Once you have a whole sheet, you give them a little cut cut, trim out all of the different shapes and they'll look like that and you do that for all the rest of the colors and patterns. Then you start to assemble. You glue um, a little, the little pieces and you kind of go from smallest to largest. Then you roll the center piece, pick up the second small one, do a little glue dab in the middle, fold it and kind of pinch it between your fingers. Put some glue along the bottom edge and continue to wrap around that center piece. You're making a flower. Yeah, exactly. So, so then you continue with the larger petals oh dear. and um, Okay. And then you continue to add as you go around until oh, you have a succulent beautiful. that looks like that. That's beautiful. Yeah, it's great. Okay, that is uh, Now, for the finishing touches. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to ask for your help here. Chris. I, was, well, I was so impressed. Like, uh -huh. you used all of the fabric. It was so efficient. I know, it's right? Like, it's it crazy. Really, really Math is impressive. a beautiful thing. Okay. But we're doing the finishing touches. Yep. I just wanted to compliment you on that. <laughs> there wasn't a lot of fabric. I love great. that you noticed that. I did. I I'm a detailed guy. We're all about the details right. here. I okay. got a glue gun. Yep, you got a glue gun. So what I'm going to have you do is pick up one of these small little succulents. We're just going to put the final touches on. Okay. So a little glue on the back end and just tuck him in right over here. Okay, I'm going to tuck him in. Yep, right perfect. Right and then deal. we'll do that one down here in this corner. There we go. Beautiful. <gasps> How easy that Brilliant. is. Brilliant. I could work for Hallmark. You could. You might Wait a minute, I do. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the last step is we're going to put a little ribbon hanger on the back. Mm -hmm. So we're going to flip her over, and then we're going to apply a little bit of glue. Do you want to help? Yeah. Please I love do. Doing okay, this. so do a little line of glue right there. A little line of glue right there. Yep. Like so that. we'll go ahead and attach the ribbon. Glue guns. So I love Oh my glue gosh. Guns. Favorite thing my in the favorite. world. It is. Okay, and then we're going to loop it around and put another line of glue right there. Uh, another line of glue right there. Yep. There we'll attach this. You can so trim you have it to down. let it dry, obviously. Just a little mm -hmm. bit. Low and temp glue guns dry pretty fast. Yeah. So, and then Good you tip. Yeah, yeah. and Look then oh, here's beautiful. your wreath. That's a great way to hang it. That's right. Yeah. yeah. We cool. have. Uh, we want to know how to wrap the, the wreath. We have a, a tape of that as well. So oh, can we take yeah. A look? Show us. So um, you'll attach the um, yarn to the wreath, and you'll see that I'm using multiple strands of yarn. Uh, it goes quick. It goes a lot yeah. faster, yeah. Um, and you'll learn how to do that on the blog Go too. Go all the way around. Yep. And then you finish it up, and then you place the succulents on the wreath. Um, just kind of get a layout for what you like and the colors, and then you can glue them all down. This is great. You know yeah. what? This will make a wonderful Mother's Day gift. I think it's so beautiful. Well, thank you so yeah. much. So what would the cost of this be, Lindsay? Um, the materials for this wreath were under $25. Wow. Yeah. It's a pretty beautiful. pretty great project. Well, and I want to be a visual merchandiser. You come on over like anytime. This is great. All right. Um, Just fantastic. It, there we go. And the cost is right there. It's yep. $25. $25. The retail $50. cost is $50. Yeah. Thank